What's up YouTube? Jeff back again and today another exciting video for you guys. Today I'm going to talk about five apps that I've been using in April. They're not all necessarily newly released apps, but they're new apps to me, apps that I've just started using. I always like to test out a lot of new apps, just something I enjoy, kind of a hobby of mine. Pass on the results to you guys. But before we get started, we got a new case going on today and uh, I want to talk about this because these guys sent this out to me to take a look at. My friends over at Simply Carbon Fiber. You guys see the Simply Carbon Fiber branding right down there, SCF. This is the forged carbon case for the Galaxy S22 Ultra, and it is absolutely beautiful. Look at how it looks when the light hits it. You got nice raised up on the top. Set your phone down like so, no problem. Very nice clicky buttons. Overall, I love this case. I particularly love the way it looks when the light hits it. If you guys wanna check it out, They've actually given me a discount code. You can hit up their website. There it is right there, simplycarbonfiber.com. You can use code JEFF10 to get 10% off your entire order. They got a lot of cool products. Not only do they have cases, they also got cases for the Pixel 6 Pro, and they did send me one of their cases for the Pixel 6 Pro, but they've also got wallets, you know, sunglasses, all kinds of other cool stuff in addition to cases, and there is the aforementioned forged carbon fiber case. And there is the regular carbon fiber case, which I do have for my Pixel 6 Pro, and I'll show you guys very soon. But I love this case. It's absolutely gorgeous when the light hits it. And the white on my Galaxy S22 Ultra contrasts the little text at the bottom beautifully. So I'll drop the link below to this if you guys want to check it out. Jeff10 is the promo code to get 10% off your order. If you guys have other questions about the case, feel free to hit me up in the comments. But let's get into today's video and uh, talk about these five apps that I've been exploring in April. Now, the first three of them are customization related, and they're actually ones that come from questions I get quite a bit in the comments. And the first one is, where do I get wallpapers from? And a lot of you know that one of my most favorite places to get wallpapers from in the past has been Backdrops, which is a great app. There's no doubt about it. But my most recent few wallpapers, I've actually gotten from a new wallpaper app, again, new to me, and that app is right there. It's called Wallberry. So Wallberry is actually where I got the app I'm using today, as you guys can see right there. But there's a lot of other ones in here that I've shown off on the channel in the last couple videos, particularly some of the gradient ones and also the AMOLED category down here. AMOLED, AMOLED, you guys let me know how. There's always a lot of controversy over how to pronounce it properly. But you guys can see a couple of the ones that I had in the last videos, that one, this one. So people were asking about where to find those wallpapers and that's where I'm getting them from. I really do like this app. It's got a huge collection uh, of quality wallpapers and uh, it's quickly becoming perhaps my favorite go-to app. I didn't think anything would ever replace backdrops as my favorite, but uh, this is getting there. The next app is another customization app that I've started experimenting with. Not sure how much I love it because as we'll talk about in a second, it does drain a little bit of battery, but it has such a cool effect that uh, I keep playing around with it and I keep coming back to using it. It's called Rain Paper. Let me go back and show you guys the icon right there. This is Vera icon back, of course, as usual. Rain Paper allows you to display your wallpaper with a rain effect on it. Now you can also add fog and other weather type effects. The way you do it, you just basically choose your image, of course, you're gonna choose your background. Go to My Images, for instance. Uh, you could go ahead and choose, so if I go to Recents, I can choose the wallpaper I have right now. You can choose a portion of that wallpaper. You can also make it larger, smaller, whatever you want to do. And then you hit done. And then it's going to apply the rain paper effect right there. Now you can actually change some of the customization in terms of like basically how much it dims it, the fogginess, the wind speed, the rain chance, the rain intensity, the storminess. So if you get like lightning and stuff like that, and then also the raindrop scale. Uh, you can also change the tint on the rain. There's a lot of cool stuff you can do playing around with this, but I'll show you guys what it looks like when you actually activate this with my current one. I'm going to do just the, well, I guess I'll do home and lock screens really quick. And then let's see what happens here. So this is what it looks like now on my home screen. You guys can see that rain paper effect and also on my lock screen. Now, one thing I will say about it uh, you saw the lightning there. One thing I will say about it is while I do like it, it does tend to drain quite a bit of battery life in my limited use with it so far. So keep in mind, if you're someone who really has a tough time getting through the day, this customization may not be worth it. 
because I don't know, it's probably gain, draining maybe an extra one and a half to 2% per hour just in my usage, but it is really, really cool. And I do like some of the customization you can do with it. The next thing is one for KWGT Reloaded. Now this is actually where I get my beautiful widget on my home screen. Everyone's always asking about where that widget comes from. It is a KWGT widget, so you do need KWGT and KWGT Pro Key, but this is the actual widget pack right there. One for KWGT Reloaded. Again, you need KWGT and KWGT Pro to run this widget pack, but that's where it comes from. This is actually the same company that makes Vera Icon Pack, which is the Icon Pack that I use. Um, and so you can actually go through and kind of see some of these widgets. They also have some nice wallpapers in here. But the most important thing, I think, is that they have the wallpaper, uh, not the wallpaper, they have the widget that I use all the time on the home screen. People are always asking about this. Now, there's a lot of other really cool widgets in the 1.4 KWGT widget pack. In fact, I could probably make an entire video on that. But for those of you who want this beautiful widget, if you do purchase the 1.4 KWGT reloaded pack, you can find this. And uh, this is definitely my favorite widget that I've ever used on an Android device. The next two are productivity things, and actually I'm going to switch them around because I just want to talk about this one first. Pocket Tube, a lot of you have probably used this. I just discovered this recently. Pocket Tube is an app that allows you to categorize and group together your subscriptions on YouTube. So for guys out there, girls too, that have a lot of subscriptions like I do, you may find it overwhelming when you log into YouTube, and YouTube doesn't have the best way of sorting, categorizing, or putting in folders. Uh, your channels that you subscribe to. So one thing that I've done here, for instance, is I went and put together a lot of the people I watch that cover Android stuff. Android Central, we got Flossie Carter, Gadget Goddess, All About Android, you know, Max Lee, Zito Max there, Droid Life. All the channels I watch for great Android content, and I put them into this folder. And there's probably some others as well. And uh, that's the main one for me because I catch up on a lot of news on YouTube, try to follow along with Android to stay current since that's what I cover. But you can also see all of your channels over here, like your current videos, all the channels you subscribe to. You can go through and just put them in categories. And the other thing I like is it shows you how many of the people in your folder have new videos. So if you go through here, these people at the top are the ones that have the new videos. And, and I think that's pretty awesome in terms of categorizing. So if you use YouTube, like I do, kind of as part of my business to keep up on the Android news, I think it's super valuable. The last one's a very simple app. It's a PDF reader. But for me, my day job, working at the university, it's a very valuable app. And it's called Moon Reader. This is the, the plus or the pro version of it. And uh, the reason I like Moon Reader is because good PDF viewers are kind of hard to find on Android. There's a lot of free ones out there, but ones that have bookmarks and all the built-in features. I don't know why I don't have this in night mode. And then the other thing that's really valuable to me is it does have Google Drive integration. And so because it has Google Drive integration, I can just switch over to my Google Drive where I store a lot of my stuff for work. I can then view all those PDFs right here. So that's a very useful thing for me. Um, if you need a full featured PDF viewer, I think it is 99 cents. It also is free with a Play Pass. It also has a way to go through and kind of save things from large things like net library projects where you might be interested in. Uh, you can also save things to your private shelf if you have like true eBooks. There's a lot of features in Moon Reader that you don't get in other PDF viewers. And so far, I'm really enjoying it using as my primary PDF viewer. So if you guys are interested in any of these apps, I'm gonna drop the links below in the description. Uh, if you guys also wanna join the uh, April giveaway, we got a few more days left. I'll drop the link in that in the pinned comment. We're giving away flagship device. So you can check that out. If you guys have any comments about these apps, questions, etc., drop them below, I'll be happy to get back to you. You can also find the Simply Carbon Fiber link if you guys want to check out this case use code jeff10 to save 10 percent off your purchase i appreciate you guys watching this video and i'll see you in the next one thanks a lot for watching